Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to multiply decimals. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. We need to multiply negative 3.9 times 4.075, and we're going to use this example to really show how to multiply decimals. Now one thing we see, a negative times a positive gives us a negative number. Keep that in mind. So let's go set this up, and we're going to have the 4 on top, uh, so we have 4.075, and we're multiplying that by a 3.9, okay? Now I'm going to ignore the decimals for right now, I'm kind of erasing that, okay? And I'm going to ignore the negative, I'm just going to keep that in mind for the end. Let's go through a process now. 9 times a 5 is a 45. We have a 5 here, and we carry the 4. 9 times 7 is a 63, plus 4 is 67. 7 comes down, 6 comes up here. 9 times 0 is 0. Then we add 6 to that, we get a 6. And then 9 times 4 is that 36. Now we start with a 3. We put a place value here because it's one digit over. Place value is 0. And we keep on going. Let's, oh, let's cross off these. We don't need them anymore. 3 times 5 is a 15 carry the 1. 3 times 7 is a 21, plus 1 is a 22, so we have a 2, we carry the 2. 3 times 0 is 0, plus 2 is 2, and 3 times 4 is a 12, right there. So now what we're going to do is add these two numbers together. 5 and 0 is a 5. 7 plus 5 is a 12, 2, carry the 1. 6 plus 1 is 7, plus 2 is 9, 6 and 2 make an 8, 3 and 2 make a 5, and good old 1 is by itself. Now let's look at our original decimals. We have one decimal place here, and 3 on the second number. We add them together, and we get a 4. So we take this number here, the decimal place right here, and move it over 4 spots to the left. 1, 2, 3, 4. And so we have a 15. 0.8925, and that kind of makes sense. 3.9, uh, 3 times a 4, or 5, because it was 15, kind of close there. But notice it was a negative times a positive. You gotta put a negative right there. And so there we have it. Our final answer here is a negative 15.8925. I hope you learned how to multiply decimals. If you did, make sure you like this YouTube channel and this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So, as always, thanks for watching.